Hey guys, it's Flaming Hippo here, and I'm gonna show you how to make a advanced bank, automatic bank, for with a combination lock, one person bank type thing. So let's jump right into it. Um, so if you get this combination code right, okay. Um, these textures are kind of old, obviously. Yeah, these textures are very old. They're not quite right, so let's just say that. And, um. Yeah, it's 1.5.2. One and, yeah, so if you get. Okay, so. The your thing won't come if you don't have the right combination lock, but if you have the right one, it will come. There it is, that's all my stuff. And even if you have the wrong combination lock, it will still send it away, but it won't come back. So then I'll try to get it back, but it won't come. So yeah, this is basically it. Uh. First step, this thing here is a device that connects as much circuits together as you want. So this right here connects um, two circuits into one, basically, from because these two power off these, which if these are turned off, then this is turned off, and that powers. So then, if this one, if this redstone right here isn't powered, then this one is powered because that's how it works. So if one of these isn't on, it will be off. So you need two positive circuits for one positive. And for the next step is, so that's basically the thing you need. It's the main invention. Anyway, step two is put this first wall with the redstone at the back. So, and put this uh, wall right here with uh four with four redstone things coming out of it like so uh step three add two of those combiny things over there i showed you earlier so to make that over here okay this is stupid i really hate lag um okay so you put these two into one, so, oops, I didn't think I could touch that, and then, yeah, so you have put those all like that, and for step four, add another one of those things again to connect those two things we made earlier, and so then that, there's a final outcome. Step five, add a minecart system and a new redstone circuit. S what? Okay. Uh, oh. Oh yeah. Okay. So what you do after this, you extend this and make a minecart system. So it comes. So it can come through here, and can go through there. So once all these are powered on correctly. The final outcome will turn this on and the minecart will fall back down. And so then it will come over here with the powered thing, with the minecart system, which is fairly simple. So you have to use that and stuff. And attach your this thing and make it go over your minecart thing and go to here so even if it's wrong and when you press a button it will turn that on and then step six add, add three switches and a button add your combination lock at the back right behind the wall with redstone torches and now add the mine cart with the chest in it congrats now you know how to make an advanced bank and my grammar used to be really bad okay so what I chose as my con combination lock was these two, right here. So let's turn all this off. So to turn it on, 
So what you do is you put redstone torches instead of that one redstone right here. And then where you want your combination lock, you put the redstone torches and get rid of that one block of redstone. So, but you can't do that to the button. The button has to stay as it is. And you put the button where it goes over the minecart and powers this rail and stuff. So put the button right there. And so since switches will alter these, so put on your combination lock, press the button, and congratulations, you just made an advanced bank system without a hopper. So congrats. Um, if I need to make a more sophisticated video for you guys, please comment. And um, this took me a while, a year ago, to make all this. but So please like, comment, and subscribe. So, yeah. Goodbye.